Yes or no uh, question, Mr. Chair. Uh, Prime Minister, you twice were found guilty of breaking the Ethics Act. After those two convictions, did you decide to read the Act? You got 14 seconds, Prime Minister. Um, yes, I have read the Act a number of times. Are you aware of Section 21? Uh, yes, since I've read the Act, I'm aware of Section what 21. What does it say? I can pull it up for you, but if you have it in front of you, you can remind me Well, it says a public is. office holder, of which you are one, shall recuse himself or herself from any discussion, de decision, debate, or vote in any matter in which, uh, uh, in respect of which he or she would be in a conflict of interest. Now, what you've admitted today is not just that you were in a conflict of interest, but that you consciously recognized in your May cabinet meeting that such a conflict might exist, that it didn't just slide by your desk, that you were consciously aware that there was a, an inappropriate link to your family that would put you in a conflict. Why did you, at that moment, not call the ethics commissioner and recuse yourself? That is simply not true, Mr. Polyev. Uh, the issue of advancing uh, issues for one, one's own. And by the way, the Ethics Commissioner uh, is looking into this right now, and I fully trust his judgment on, on determining it. Uh, but at the same time, my concern around recusing myself was a question around perceptions, uh, because okay. I knew so, full well that this Canada Summer Students Grant Program was not going up. to directly benefit uh, my mother or my brother. Your, your 16 seconds are up. Years. Your 16 seconds are up. I'm going to ask you again, Thank because you no, no, nobody, you. nobody believes you when you say you don't know how much money your family has got from the WE Group. So you've had a month to look into that. You knew you were going to testify here. Again, how much money total have your brother, mother, and spouse received from this organization? How much? That information has been publicly shared, but I will highlight Well, then tell me what mother, it is. Uh, my mother how much? has- uh, Just has the dollar worked, figure. Uh, throughout her life- The dollar uh, figure, Prime Minister. In various ways and is uh, proud how much? of the work that she's done, and I'm proud of her How as much? Well. Uh, I'm looking for can, a dollar figure. We can, we can get that number for you if you like. It's been in, out in the media. It's been in the media, but you don't know it? I don't have it in front of me. And quite you don't frankly, know how much your family has received from this organization, which you tried to give a half billion dollars, really? Can I answer, Mr. Polyev? I'm waiting. You haven't done an answer so far. Let's make this the first one. My mother uh, has worked as an advocate. The dollar figure, Prime Minister. Uh, speaker uh, for How many good organizations across the country. Mr. Prime Minister, you are, she is you, proud uh, you are being asked a direct a question at a parliamentary a committee. Support her because she does her own work. And I'm proud of order, her work. Point of order. Point of order. I uh, do not. Uh, feel that and it is my the responsibility to peer into uh, the work my mother is doing because I have P point of order to suspend. She's doing um, point, point of order. Uh, point of I, order I, to I suspend. I've learned that the, uh, the the chairperson's power has gone out and is no longer part of this meeting. Um, uh, may I propose that we it's okay? We for can uh, we can keep minutes for uh, Prime Minister and I can uh, continue talking. No. no. I suspected that might be a problem. It's very convenient timing for the lights to go out. <laughs> Look, I got a message to the effect that his power has gone out. I have no reason to, to distrust him. I hope uh, you don't but, pull the uh... fire alarm now. Yeah, well, look, that, there's no intent in my own private home here in the middle of a pandemic. I don't have a fire alarm. Um, I, I propose the, the, the general the general process is that the vice chair assumes uh, assumes the chairing of the meeting. So we'll continue. And that would, yeah, that, would be, that would be me. So uh, we'll continue the meeting, um, and I now give the floor to the member for Carleton. Um, Mr. Prime Minister, you have. Uh, I'm going to ask you one last time. How much did your family get from this organization? How much? Have you read the Conflict of Interest uh, Act, Mr. Yes, Polyev? I have. How does it define family? I'm asking you. How does it, I'm define, asking how does it define family? I'm asking family? you how much your family got. The Don't Conflict you? of Interest Act defines family right. as spouse and direct okay. dependents. Point of order. Point of order. Point of order. So you're not going to answer the question, order, really not, so you're not going to answer the question then. Uh, from, so you're not going to answer the question about how much your family received. Okay, you're right. Hold on, gentlemen. If you. For, uh, Mr. With we, and it was clear Mr. Prime Minister, Commissioner, ahead of time. Okay, Mr. Can I welcome back Wayne Easter? Can I welcome back Wayne Easter, a man we've deeply missed? Come on, <laughs> Mr. Uh, look, uh, I had you things know, under control me, for you while you were gone. I, I oh, imagine that Wayne. Pierre. It wouldn't be the first time you tried to put my lights out, and that's exactly <laughs> what happened. Pierre, we get a thunderstorm here. Anyway, uh, uh, where will you're 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 well into your five minutes, but go with one last question. Um. You, uh, Mr. Uh, Trudeau, uh, I'm going to conclude by asking you, um, you claim that you have no knowledge of the amount that has been paid in expenses to your spouse. You correctly pointed out that the Act uh, defines family as including a spouse. Therefore, you, knew, you know you're under investigation uh, regarding the Act. 
I'm going to ask you again, how much in total, and I'm looking for a dollar figure here, sir, how much did your spouse receive in reimbursed expenses or other benefits from this organization? How much? The Mr. original Brandon, question, Mr. Polyev, was how much was my immediate family? I asked you a different question now. For how much? Uh, Mr. Worker. Polyev, the Prime my Minister mother, has the floor. My wife has uh, never been paid since I was Prime Minister. Reimbursed for expenses. Mr. Polyev, Mr. Polyev, we could, could we please have order? We'll allow the Prime Minister to answer the question, and then we'll move on to Mr. Zero. Mr. Zero. hasn't answered one question. Uh, sorry, Julie. Uh, Mr. Prime Minister, you have about 30 seconds here. Uh, the Ethics Commissioner. Uh, has fully cleared my wife to continue her advocacy and her work uh, with We Charity and other organizations. How much? In, uh, in, uh, in the kind of work that she's been doing all her life. Just the dollar she's figure. She's doing it unpaid for We. Dollar. She's not being paid uh, by We for her advocacy or for her podcasts. They are simply reimbursing expenses. for expenses. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Mr. Prime Minister.